guys, so today my TXT Memories for Story DVD came in the mail and I'm so excited to open it. I thought I would film an unboxing. I don't really know a lot like of the details that's in this. I didn't like spoil myself on anything. So I'm so excited to open this up um, for you guys and take a look at what's inside. So let's get started. This is the pre-order gift, maybe. Maybe it's not, maybe everyone gets this, I don't know, but oh my gosh, look how precious they are. Oh my gosh, they're so small. This brings me back to how they were when they debuted and oh, this makes me think of the um, that show they had for their US showcase, One Dream. Oh, my roommate and I were obsessed. We watched that entire show together. <laughs> they look so small. They're cute. And then here, I don't know what this is. Uh, is it just a clear photo? Is it a bookmark? Ooh, okay, it's a little transparent. This must be some sort of clear bookmark or clear poster or something. Very cute. It looks like it's from um, Dreamcatcher Magic era. I love Funky's like silver blonde, Yuki Kai's long hair. Cute. Let's put that back. Listen, back's just plain. Huh. All right. Now on to this bad boy. Uh, let's take the plastic off. Look at the back real quick. This is moments of alwaysness. Very cute, very cute. All right. This thing is heavy. I love the packaging. It's very pretty. 2018 to 2020. Oh, oh. So pretty. Okay, what's in here? All right. I'm so scared. I don't want to like accidentally see the photo card or anything. Um, oh, 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 don't look. I don't know what that is. Okay, I didn't see anything. All right, is this? Poster. <gasps> Very cute. Oh my gosh. Are they painting? Oh. Alright, there's the poster. And I believe these are the cards. I think we're good. Okay, put those to the side. I'm moving on to this big book, very thick book. <sighs> All right, we're gonna do a flip through. Um, I might speed it up a little just because this book is huge. Um, but I'll just take a look and I'll probably just fangirl over how cute they are for like the entire time. Let's go. These photos are from like their pre-debut, I believe. Um, I didn't stand TXT from debut, but I, I, I have been a MOA for about like an entire year now, coming up. So probably around Dream Chapter Magic, I think. Right? If I'm right. Oh my god, they look so cute. So I know when they were announced as like members of the group, they took these um, flower photos. These are stunning. Chapter Star, right? Is this the debut showcase? I think so because I recognize uh, his purple sweatpants. 
cute. This is blue orangeade. Cat and dog. Tasty's music videos are amazing. Oh, look at his ears. All right, next section. Dream Checker Magic. I think Dream Checker Magic is still uh, my favorite album by them so far. I love Eternity so much. I really love like every single album so far. Absolutely love them, but I think Dream Chapter Magic is still my favorite. The songs on there are amazing. I love Runaway. Cute. I remember when I first saw all these photo shoots, I was like enamored. It was amazing. I just like fell in love with them and it they made me fall in love with K-pop in general. And I owe it all to TXT. I love this music video. Bumpy's hair. Oh. Oof. Ouch. Too cute. Magic Island. I like rewatched Magic Island a trillion times. I love that song. Nope. Angel or Devil? I'm weak for Angel or Devil. This is still probably one of my favorite videos we've ever done. It's also one of my favorite songs by them. There's Motion Awards. Ooh. Very nice, very nice. Oh, no. I'm a Gryffindor, by the way. <laughs> Cute. I can't believe it's already been like basically two years. Like, wow. I've only been a fan of theirs for a year, but it feels like forever ago when I first saw Crown. Eternity was like my first comeback with TXT. I became a fan of theirs after Magic was already out. So Eternity, oh, Eternity was like really awesome to be a part of. Like it's be a part of like my first ever comeback, I believe. Oh wow, that Puma got some amazing photos. Huh. My friend would die over this photo. <laughs> he looks so good. Can't you see me? A bop, a bop and a half. Next section, MOA Academy in March. Oh my god, do you guys remember MOA Academy? Little. Feel like I'm so happy they made something like this like the first the 2018 to 2020 like everything together everything they'd done so far compiled together in like one beautiful photo book so like years from now when we have like comeback after comeback we can look back at like their first memories and like cry over how baby they are 
beautiful. Oh, here's thanks to's at the end. I don't know what they say. Oh, here's the discs. Oh, very nice. So disc one. Disc one looks like this. They're very pretty. Disc two. this bad boy up. How do I close this? Like that? That's kind of weird. It like stays open. Huh. Oh. I think there's supposed to be a magnet or something? Odd. Alright, we'll leave that off for now. <laughs> Alright. Now for these two photos. Ready? One, two, three. Oh my goodness. Look how cute he is. Zoom in. They're very cute. The Tomorrow by Together with Moments of Alwaysness. Love it. Oh my gosh. He's so baby. He's so small. All right, that's my photo card. And this is, ooh, another cute little like photo. I love the like low quality Polaroid feel of this. All right, I pulled Suvin. Here's the poster. And the clear thingy and the postcard. And that is everything guys for the first TXT memories, the first story. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I will be very excited to put these away in my binder. Um, I'm about to text my friend right now and tell her who I got. <laughs> All right. See you guys later. Bye.